now for outskirts, which has a lot of skips, which is good. This level is pretty quick, and I probably did this one the most, so should be the most helpful for explaining things on this level. I really get into the loading. So at this level, there's lots of like skips and run bys. You can just ditch a bunch of enemies and get to the next area, and then beat the level pretty fast. And like usually like five or six minutes ish if you're like doing a good run without dying. Can I start CPR? What's going on? Take it off, Marines. I don't know if I best ever for something or not. If not, it was just fine. Just grunt down there. You don't have to kill him. You can just jump up here. If you jump on a light and jump on the slope, then you look behind you go over here. Right, where am I going? Yeah, up there. Jump over here. And you run backwards up along the slope. And use this weird thing to get up here. And run this one on, um, or like run all them on. Oh, they grab, sorry. This one doesn't look that different on both graphics, but it's better to do classic because everything is what it actually is, kind of thing. Like, bridge would be a bit different. Oops. You, can, you can grenade jump up that fast for faster, but I just do that. You run over here, make sure you don't slip there, just slope and mess up your jump and make you fall. Sergeant, I need you, you on that bird. On the tree if I land it. Right. My pelicans There's some enemies there, so you're gonna get shot if you miss that. But city. if you jump out the tree, you jump down there. I don't want to make a rogue, so I don't know. When it says loading, enemies are gonna spawn here. Your checkpoints, then run back and throw a grenade. So once you deal with that. Right out here. Right, just jump down, ditch any enemies that come, ditch the phantom. Just keep running. Dodge, dodge that. Then just keep going straight, you'll see a ghost of the pelican. Uh, get in that and then just take off and the rest of the mission is basically just drive away with a ghost. The highest concentration of Covenant troops is directly below the carrier. I don't think they want you okay, to get on yeah, board. That was a very optimal route. I should have went down around. That bridge is the most direct route to the city center. I understand that because we're on, on heroic, not legendary, but it's either go left there for a bit quicker, and then if you go around to the right where the beach was, it's probably Pete, safer. The carrier just launched a wave of pods. They're watch out for the sniper rifles. You should face the ghost. Like there's one there, so it's better to face the ghost toward him. This Black tunnel links there. up to the bridge. It's full of rats, if you know what I mean. But it beats swimming. Alright, now the warthog comes here, I'm pretty sure. Go here. I've been analyzing the Covenant tactical chatter. Back. They're surprised. Yeah. Confused. That's how you get the warthog. When you get checkpoint, go there and go here. back. Not you and me. And oh, the warthog is humanity on uh, Earth. way better than oh, the um, I know, but it does help explain why they came And you were like in cover better, so it's better to And the marine will shoot at people. So that's good. I like to take the lower ramp because the drones are shooting at you and messing you up. Go straight through there. And you watch the bus if possible. Scared to shoot. I don't think it can hit you. Like that. Watch these things. And then the shadows spawn here. Watch out for those. Our uh, warthog is kind of smoking. It's a regarbo. Uh, it's good to drive up here. The Covenant must be trying to regroup. Don't let them. If it tries to shoot like you or the or something, 
If you're in the ghost, you get hit a lot with the Warthog. Don't seem to get hit as much. And if you do, the Warthog has more health. So you should be a little better. You know, it's like they're smoking when you get destroyed. This mission is pretty easy, so if you're just starting speedruns on this game, if you're trying to get the monopolized achievement, it's good to try out this one, because it's pretty, pretty easy. You should drive with stuff and dodge the ramp into them. Actually, I don't think there's any more enemies, so it's probably more optimal to drive on the road down there. Yeah, because it would have been in the corner, so it would have been faster. Well, before I leave. Shadow over there. Okay, take a tight corner so the tire can hit you and then do that damage. That one's a lot easier than the first. It just wasn't skips great right, to kill anyone. Yeah, I best is 4.45 there. Oh, exclamation for 5.22, not bad. 